When we spoke to you last year, you told us you had more homeless students than ever before. Now a year later, what's different? It's gotten worse. Two years ago, we had about 1,300 homeless children. Last year, we ended up with over 1,700 homeless children. Do you have more families living in cars today than you had before? Absolutely. This year, I've identified 30 children that lived in a car. 30. I've never seen that before. How do you hear about these families living in cars? I get a phone call from a guidance counselor saying that they found a family in the Walmart parking lot. And I go out there right away. And then what? And then I put them in a motel. Most likely that's the first place, the most available place. Shelters at 100% capacity. They have no place else to go. The money for the hotels, mm -hmm. where does all that come from? All donations. That's our community. It's not a government program? No. No. The government programs is, is, is limited um, and they're maxed out. So our community has stepped forward. The nation has stepped forward, really, and, and helped us out.